Hey folks, um, I thought I would make this a really quick video on how to make your, how to configure your NVIDIA driver uh, such that when you boot up and you plug in a monitor, you plug in the same monitor, you should get the same default type of screen. I know for some folks you'll actually notice things such as, you'll notice um, uh, that this um, screen will be smaller or it will be a different size, it will not be the correct size. And normally, you have a, a um, program that's called NVIDIA Settings. That if you launch it, it will give you these settings here. And if you go into the advanced, you can read it a little more. And normally, you can adjust all of these things. This, is, this video will not explain how you do that. You should know how to do that already. What I want to show you is that sometimes a few of you will have problems um, once you've set this up, you know, you apply it and your resolution works and everything, but the next time you reboot, nothing um, sticks. So, how do we fix that? Well, actually quite simple, really. Everything that you do in here, the reason it's not sticking is because you're not running it as sudo. Um, now, if you run it from the applications window again, this is not sudo. Okay, as a matter of fact, notice that this has a different color. Okay, you're going to notice that if we run it from sudo, which is quite simple, just run uh, sudo NVIDIA setting, and you're going to notice, um, well, it won't always change color. The reason this changes color is because my individual user has a slightly different theme. But either way, here's the point, is your display configuration, whatever it is, Okay, just make sure it is exactly what you want. When it's there, you see where it says here, save to the X configuration file? Okay, if you click there, you're going to notice it's going to save it to this location, which is where it usually should be, by the way. There's another location, the XFree86, I think. None of you that I'm working with directly should worry about, should use that one. Any one of you that I've worked with directly should be working with the xorg.conf. Okay, and if you look at the preview here, we can actually check it out. And I recommend you do this, by the way. Don't just follow this blindly like some dummy. Okay, pay attention and look at this. Okay, this is what the new settings should be. Okay, and if we were going to go and let's just say we go into sudo vim etsy x11 xorg.conf. Over here where it says your option meta modes. This is where it's actually telling you what you want it to be, okay? So, what you've changed, now, this is the, this is the correct setting, okay? If we actually want to have, if we want to look at our previous settings, you can see here that our previous settings had, as the first option, this was um, 19, and it had a different viewport setting. Whereas in this one, our current options have our viewport settings, again, um, right here, zero, zero, okay? And if you look here, it's zero, zero. The reason I have this, by the way, for me it changes, is because I have two different monitors that I plug this into. So when I plug it into one, I have to change the settings here, and then I plug it into another, I change the settings. Now there's another way we can do this, which is basically we can save this file, and I'll show you later, but for now, I just thought, for most of you, you don't really change monitors. You just use a single monitor. So whichever monitor you're going to spend like 85 to 95 percent of your time with, just make sure that this xorg.conf file, the one that you're saving here, make sure that it's in that configuration, okay? And if it is, then just click Save, okay? It's going to say Save. It shouldn't do anything, really. You quit. You tell it quit. And the next time you reboot, you should notice that now your screen should, your resolution should be fine. You should have no problems with it. Like I said, um, everything should work. The big point here was sudo. Once again, sudo NVIDIA settings. There's other programs that are related to the NVIDIA driver, by the way. I thought I'd show you there. Um, you can check those out, or you can check out this link. I'll put, I'll put, it, I'll put it on the video. So, sorry about that. It's just very early in the morning. I've, I've had a long night. <laughs> but I still thought I'd help you out a little, okay? So, anyway, um, hope that helps out. 
Any questions, let me know. Okay? Okay, take care.